MSNBC has an important announcement for all of us to hear regarding COVID-19. Please stay tuned and listen to this important announcement. It's not something to laugh about. Try not to laugh. COVID's dangerous. It's lethal. Yeah. It's a bit like the beef Notorious B.I.G. used to rap about when he said beef is when you... <laughs> COVID-19 is dangerous. It's lethal. It's kind of like the beef. Biggie Smalls used to rap about, remember the beef between him and 2 Peasy? I remember that back in my day, do you? Back to you, Frank, in the studio. <laughs> Biggie, listen, this is, this, is, this is gold. All right. <laughs> this is just gold. He used to rap about when he said, beef is when your moms ain't safe up in the streets. <laughs> That's what Biggie Smalls used to rap about. When saying your moms ain't safe in these COVID nineteen streets, <laughs> just it just this is this clip is like a fine wine. It just gets better the more you listen to it. It's lethal. It's a bit like the beef Notorious B.I.G. used to rap about when he said, "Beef is when your moms ain't safe up in the streets. Beef is when I see you, guaranteed to be in ICU." <laughs> Who takes this news organization seriously? I mean, come on. I mean, come on. This is just so ridiculous. <laughs> Guaranteed to be I see you end up in the I see you. You see, so get your COVID nineteen vaccinated one more time, because I and honestly, this clip gets better with age. It's lethal. It's, it's lethal. a bit like the beef Notorious B.I.G. used to rap about when he said, "Beef is when your moms ain't safe up in the streets. Beef is when I see you, guaranteed to be in ICU." Well, when COVID sees you, <laughs> you can end up in ICU. Maybe not at the same rate as Biggie's beef, but that's the COVID. Ooh, ooh. Where are you? <laughs> Maybe COVID-19 is not as big of a beef as what Biggie Spock was dealing with, but... I don't understand how you can say these things. Look at the camera, look and talk to the American public and say, <laughs> say this seriously without laughing and just continue on point. It shows you how big of an actor these people are. Okay, just, I mean, let's just, I need to hear his explanation one more time. Well, when COVID sees you, you can end up in ICU. Maybe not at the same rate as Biggie's beef, but that's the point about risk. You don't want to test these streets and risk ending up in the ICU. COVID's dangerous. Don't test these Wuhan lab streets, ladies and gentlemen. It's not something to, to take lightly. This is a serious matter that needs to be handled. Oh. I'm just so thankful. I sit here today and I'm just, I'm thankful for MSNBC. I'm thankful for what they bring to the table. I'm thankful for their journalist integrity. Uh, I'm thankful for just speaking facts and getting in with the general public. And well, you, I'm assuming this is a liberal push to get more African Americans, the black voters, to get vaccinated because they are such a low percentile right now. Uh, I mean, really, I could just imagine somebody in the boardroom right now is like, you know, at the vaccination rate of African Americans is incredibly low. Frank, can you get up any ideas of uh, how to get more of the black African Americans to get the jab? Uh, do you remember the hip hop artist Frank? Biggie Smalls, who killed him? I mean, I was just like, whoa, wait. we haven't got to the bottom of that. But yeah, anyways, what are we going to do? We could try to intermingle some of the hip-hop community. And not only that, we'll do a throwback from the 90s. <laughs> That'll get the kids vaccinated. <laughs> We're just going to bring up old hip-hop artists like Juvenile and Biggie Smalls and, and uh, Cool and the Gang. <laughs> What is going on? <laughs> Tell me you're out of touch without telling me you're out of touch.
Thank you, MSNBC. I appreciate everything you bring. Literally, I appreciate everything you bring to the table because you're beautiful, you're amazing, and you're, well, you're getting paid more than I'll ever get paid, and you're, well, thank God for you. Seriously, I'm thankful for you. Keep doing you, boo. You make me happier every single day. I need more of this information. Have a great day, everyone. And that's the silliest video I've found today.